Immediately she saw my husband. She just twink these eyes on him. She tapped me, said, Bay, ha, wow, your husband is hot. I said, hot? That very day. If you say the way that your husband look at me, that very day. But what happened now is that your husband toasted me. Okay. I asked her that question. Do you accept him? You said my husband toasted you. Then, what else again? You accept or you not accept? Simple. What's up, guys? It's your girl, Nene Baby. So, guys, today, I have this woman here with me. She had something she wants to narrate to my audience. She has this problem currently. Guys, please, let's listen to her and also advise her. Things they happen for this life. People gain mind. Like, let me give her mic so she will tell my audience the reason why she contacted me. Okay, ma, please don't mention your name. Just go straight and talk your story. Thank you so much. I really appreciate it because when I called you, you really answered and tell me to come over. So I'm here to tell the others my story, my true, real life story, what happened to my life. There is this lady that I met. I met her. So we started growing this relationship. She come to my house sometimes, if I'm less busy. Then one day she now called me that Please, can I see you? I want to roll my kid from school. She need a very good school around this place. You know, I just come back from America. I said, wow. The so, woman is telling you that she came back yes, from America. Yes, the woman told me that she came back from America and that she need a very good school to put her son in. I said, okay. Then both of so. We started strolling around to look for a school. Anyone that points out said no. Anyone I go, we got and said, oh, the money is high. You know, if you got there, he said, she will say the money is high. I said, okay. But, okay, let me introduce you. The last one now. Let's go to my, my kid's school so that you can be able. So we now got there. We met, um, we now got there. She liked the school premises. She liked everything that she saw that very day. So they now pay her the fee and other things. She said, wow, but it's too expensive, but it's okay because the school is very close to, to the house. So the relationship started growing. She started coming to my house, be calling me on phone. If I post something on Insta uh, status, uh, she will comment, you know. So one day, as this relationship was growing, she now came to my house one day. She sat down. We started gisting. After then, our kids started playing. Then my husband now came back from work that very day. Immediately she saw my husband. She just twinked these eyes on him. I noticed that about me. I don't really fancy all those things. I don't really. So I just wave it off. Say, and where shall they just because of the her eyes got to him or something like that? I wave it out. Then the relationship started now. After the after my husband now came in, after blah blah, she just he just dressed off and went out. She tapped me, say, Bay, ha, wow, your husband is hot. I say, hot. And what kind of statement is that? Someone that you saw today, you are telling me that he's hot. What kind of thing is that? Please, don't, 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 I don't want to involve anything about my marriage, this relationship. If you want like that, I don't want this kind of relationship. So that's why I told, and I said, no, 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 it's not like that. That's how we, 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 we cherish men outside there and, and in, in America. I said, okay, yeah, in Nigeria, don't do that. I don't do that. She said, okay, don't worry. So one day, as she called me, three days later, she called me, say, hey, madam, I want to tell you something, and it's very, very important. I said, what is it? He said, okay, I should come and meet her. 
and went. She now she now said, hmm. She did this hmm severally. I said, what is it now? What can't you, you are just are you pulling my leg or what? He said, hmm, my sister, hmm. Men are very, very bad. I said, what is it? And meanwhile, immediately when she called me, my heart, she said, please, can you come and meet me? So, so, please. I want to tell you something that is very vital. I said, hey, my heart sank from my tummy. Bah! I said, yeah. What kind of story that this woman will tell me now? Please, God. So when I now met, eventually met her, she said she started dipping in, breathing in, breathing, and I said, what is it? Now just tell me I'm here. She said, hmm, men, men. I said, you are, I've been here since over this thing. You have not even said anything. You are keep on saying, hmm, men, hmm, men. Tell me, let me go. I have things to do. He said, okay, 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 okay. Do you know that, uh, that day that we met in the house? I said, yes. The, the first time that he came to my house, I said, yes. I said, what happened that day? Is there anything? I said, hmm. As I met your husband the next day. As she met your husband the next day? The next okay, day. Okay, please speak out. As she met my husband the next day, and my husband toasted her. <laughs> and he did not even know that day that he, that day that I even met your husband that very, I did not even know that he is your husband because I've, because I've known this man since. I said, are you okay? What are you telling me? You came for the first time in my house and you met my husband and now you are telling me that you have met him. Okay, when? And when do you come back from America? According to you, you said you come back from America. When do you come back? She said, my friend, forget about that. I'm just telling you thing that is happening that's under your nose that you did not know. I said, please. I don't want to believe anything because I don't want anything to spoil my marriage. I've not spoiled somebody's money. I don't want anybody to spoil. No, so no. It's not that I'm spoiling your marriage. I'm not spoiling, but I'm, I'm just telling you the reality. The first day that I met your husband that I did not even know that he is your husband is when I was going to church that very day. He was with your daughter. That is when I know, say, wow, this, 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 um, this girl and this man, they are really resembled. I said, okay, what happened that day? That very day. If you see the way the husband looked at me, that very day. So I was surprised when I saw her in your house. I said, wow, is he your husband? That's the reason why I said, wow, is he your husband? He's cute. I said, okay, okay. So now that you okay, called she, me. She said she has known your husband. That's why she shouted, wow. Wow, yes. She said, wow, she know my husband. That's why... She screamed that, said, wow, my husband is cute. I said, okay, what, what happened that you just called me? Is it all that you called me for? He said, no. But what happened now is that your husband toasted me, toasted you. That your husband toasted her? Eh, that the way that your husband used to look at me. He, he used to say that, is it this woman's husband or somebody else? But when I now come closer to him, I say, oh, this is reality. This is uh, this woman's husband. But why is he doing like this? But the question I asked her, do you accept? Do you accept when you're, you were asking her? Yes. Whether she accept when your husband toasted her? Yes. Okay. I asked her that question. Do you accept him? <laughs> uh, he said, oh, why are you saying like that now? Why are you talking? How can I do that? Don't you know that you are my friend? I said, forget about English. Do you, do you accept him? You said my husband toasted you. Then, what else again? You accept or you not accept? Simple. And I said, it's not that I want to, it's not that I want to accept, but, but I didn't. I didn't. That is why I want, that is why I said, let me just say so that you'll be very, very 
careful. You know that men, they are not, uh, they are not predicted like that. They are not this thing. I said, okay. I thank God that you did not accept. But if you really, if you, if you really want it, that is no problem. He said, really? Really? I said, yes. So after everything, after when you have discussed all this thing, although I felt it when she told me that, you know, when someone walks to you and tell you that your husband did this, it will pain you. Someone that you lived so many years with, you, you wedded with, you did everything with, although even though that he's doing it, but your own close friends have the mind, have the, mind the gods, to, to tell you this, you. to tell me the undo. I just look at her and say, what did my husband say in, him, in on her that is not on me? That's the question I ask myself. How is the woman? The woman, I don't know. I don't know how would I even describe her. I don't know. But in terms of beauty, me, I, undo, I don't know whether I'm uh, pretty or not, but at least I better. So, the, 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 what, what she told me, it hit my heart because he is my husband. It hit my heart. My tummy, my heart sank to my tummy. I said, what is going on? I couldn't, when I reached home, I pretended that it did not hurt me with a smile and other things. I pretended so that she would tell me everything deeply. Okay, in front but, of her, you pretended as nothing happened. Yes, I pretended that, that as if that it, it did not hurt me. But it hurt me so deeply. I felt so bad. Everything about me changed. My system changed immediately. So when I said, okay, there is no problem. Thank you so much for informing me. I will be very careful and watch him. Even though he's going to work, I watch him. So, and I went home. And I started thinking, should I ask him? I couldn't eat that very day. When my husband came back from work, I just look at him from head to toe. Is it this man or somebody's or someone's else? So, after that night, when, when, when my husband trying to make love, I said, no, I'm not in the mood to do, to do this with that anger. My husband said, what is it? I said, I don't, I'm not in that mood. He said, oh, okay, there is no problem, but anything that bothers you, please, just say it out and free yourself. I said, nothing bothers me, but something do eat me up because I want to ask him this question. I want to ask him. But I don't have the, that God, and I know the kind of man he is. And besides, why even fear me, baffles me so much is because when I look at one again, he's no Nigerian man. That's what scared me. Say maybe what this woman said, it must, must it must be true, or, or maybe not. But, the woman is just forging, or or maybe the woman just forged some things to break my home. That's what I think. But nevertheless, I want to ask him this question, please, because this thing has been eating me up since over how many, uh, 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 over two weeks now. I want to ask him, I want to, I, I, I won't just ask him this. Is it good for me to ask my husband? Is it true that he's dating so so person? You know? So that is why. I came to, I came to her. I called her. I explained everything to her, for her to give me advice. Please, I need your opinion, your advice. I need it. So now, eh, the the only thing that crossed my mind, if it's me, I think is. If you let for me, I think it's better you ask your husband since you want to ask. Since the thing is bothering you and your husband is the only person that will give you, I believe he will not lie to you now. Although men lie, concerning this one now, they can lie. They can never come straight and tell you, yes, they are doing it. That's another confusing part. But if your husband will be able to tell you truth, like you know him when he's saying the truth, I think you could have just asked him. But you, 
is now what kind of husband do you have is this somebody that you will ask this kind of a thing and he will pick offense what kind of person even if he will pick offense let it be that you have free your mind so your mind will be free you need to ask at least to know the kind of person you are calling your friend even that woman said to have that god to come straight to you and be telling you this i don't think this relationship is going to is a good one it's not really a good one is she married or just she has a baby she's married her husband and her husband is with her as well but according to her you said that the base that i'm i'm the, she just come back yes yeah, she come back from america according to her with her husband with her no no her husband was here in nigeria okay. according to her she said her husband uh, fled a lot her husband fled a lot that's why she came down to yeah, stay with him to stay with him yeah. so that is the reason why okay so and again keep praying for your marriage this woman she's too small to make you unhappy in your own home why she will be happy in her own home no matter what don't take it as anything but still if you feel like you can ask your husband hear from him but just look for the time that he will be happy so you get the truth from him put it in a tone that it will not be harsh one just for you to get that perfect answer you need from him and again you need to distance yourself from that woman we don't know her plan serious so guys please drop your opinion on the comment section do you think that she should ask hmm. the husband or she should just die the matter like that what do you think what's your opinion what's your own advice to her share this video guys and let's be careful we don't trust anybody now let's just be very careful all right thanks for watching guys